Hello, internet lords and ladies, boys and girls, and welcome to Steel's Nuclear Throne Guidebook. Blah blah. Guidebook, episode 110. So we are gonna do the normal thing. And who have we not played as recently? Probably this terrible character, Melting. Uh, any crowns? Any crowns? Any crowns? Minus one base health for bigger explosions? It doesn't actually work with this thing. Hmm. I mean, we could just do Crown of Blood, but that would just be probably a bad idea. Crown of Destiny could be fun, I guess. Let's go for it. Ah, Euphoria. So here's where we get all the weapon specific mutations right off the bat. Because that's what this meme is. And if this, let's say like if these first two runs don't work out, I'll just go back to playing regular old melting. That way we don't have to get through all this torture. But at least we get an extra mutation. And then maybe I'll take the brain power thing. Oh, rip. Oh, impact risk is pretty good with melting. Maybe we'll take that brain power thing that gives us three more mutations for half of our health. So that could be cool. Cautious. This is a pretty good start. I mean, it's no strong. St <sighs> I mean, there's nothing really particularly hard about this start. I don't know why I'm having such trouble. The more maggots, in, the merrier, to be honest, because that means more maggots, which means bonus. Bonus, uh, rads. Life, uh, finds a way. Screwdriver. Strong spirit. Wow. GG. Oh, don't, don't F it now. Triple machine gun, no thanks. Wait until you see that Magaden pumping a lot before you blast it with the wrench. That way you can get it in one shot. No real guidelines for the maggots, just go ham. Impact wrist, hey! This one's not going so bad. If only I had an actual crossbow. Help, help, help. Okay. Oh, goodness. Okay, turn around and fire that guy. Like, like your name's Donald Trump. Ooh, how do you like them apples? Taste your own medicine. Hmm? Okay, let's not be ridiculous. We managed to kill him somehow. Okay, just bob and weave, bob and weave. Like it's your job. In a way, it is, but it, it isn't. Nice. Okay. Well... <laughs> Don't you dare. Okay, we're still alive. Lost strong spirit, but it's okay. Because this is going to be bloodlust. Ah, back muscle. Still pretty good. Okay, just stay calm. We have a shovel in the sewers. It one shots all of our enemies here. Just be really careful. Make sure you swing it early, baby. Not too late, because otherwise you're going to be dead. Okay, just murder this man. Murder this rat man. Thank you, Impact Wrist. Thank you, Impact Wrist. Laser pistol, yes. Save me, laser pistol. Got another level up, my goodness. We're gonna have five mutations going into the scrapyard. That's pretty crazy. I mean, we don't really get to pick them, but judging from the ones we have right now, it could still be pretty good. Hammerhead. Well, I had to 
had to open my big mouth. Hammerhead's actually not that bad. I, I underrate it frequently. I could just get a goddamn health kit from these stingy bastards, and uh, everything would be alright. Wow. Save me. My wrists is literally carrying this run. No, okay. Steady. Oh, that's Hammerhead doing its work. Just gotta be cautious. Just plow through like you own the goddamn place. Okay. Oh, that's the end of the level, apparently. I feel like I've missed out on a rad canister. Wait, can I walk through this? That's pretty funny, actually. I wonder if I should do that on the side where it's open. That'd be kind of funny. Alright, well, I didn't miss out on anything. There was nothing in that bottom corner, so... It's as if we don't even have strong spirit. <laughs> even a flame will kill me. No! <laughs> Long arms. I kind of hope we get a wrench now. Um, um, um... Greatest dodging, greatest dodging of all time. My situational awareness is pretty good, I'd say. Hey, look, a wrench. It's like this run is scripted or something. Except, except I don't know how to do that in Nuclear Throne. Gamma Guts. Ooh. I think the only reason Gamma Guts I didn't take damage from that guy is because I had already hit him twice with a wrench. Man, Melting looks even more dead with Gamma Guts. Absurd. Crazy. Thank you for the energy. Oh my god. Oh dear. Yeah. These may be like the bottom three on my mutation list. Actually, that's not true. Shotgun Shoulders is definitely lower. But we're sort of making it work, just basically ignoring the fact that we have Gamma Guts, except for this guy, because I hate him. Wah, here I come. I'm like the Kool-Aid man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I totally need to kill someone like that. 69 kills. What a mean. Oh, great. There goes all of our hammerhead. Got him to do the two blood explosions and then a swing with the wrench, which is kind of what I was trying to do, but I didn't verbally say it because it was dumb. But because it sounds like we will rock you in the boom boom. Oh, whatever. I don't really want to sing right <laughs> now. I'm I'm in this zone. Damn it. You wouldn't get it. Ooh, shovel. Even if it's cursed. Okay, curse shovel. Be careful. How is this working? I mean, our mutations aren't terrible, and I haven't taken damage yet, so that's also a plus. There's bloodlust, useless as it is. I mean, at this point in the game, it's like literally useless, it's because. Even just taking one damage from the flames doesn't really matter. I, I, except for protecting me from dying to the flames again. Which I guess is kind of helpful for these jerks. I wonder if I could whack that guy. Oh, what's that? Oh, pop gun. No. Oh, I guess this means we're going to be fighting the cursed caves. Let's see how that goes. 
And the guts isn't as OP as it used to be, so we would take damage from all of those spiders. So I'm not enthused about going there. I guess we'll just keep this laser pistol, even though I'm not really using it, because it's useful for taking guys out at long range, like those guys. Wow. Instant death. Um, um, Hammerhead saved my life. Um, I'm afraid when this assassin comes at me. Oh, but we were No worries. For the rest of your GD days. Wow. Ooh, I like that minigun. Take one damage from those? Oh shit. I did not know you could only take you like had the potential to take one damage from that. That's nuts. Nuts and bolts. Ratchet and clank. Nuts and bolts. Oh, so close actually. That is what blows my mind. Alright. Third time's a charm. Here we go. Plutonium hunkers, pretty good. Save me, IDPD. You're my only hope. No, but like, they're gonna, probably gonna be the ones to kill me on this run. You know what the unfortunate thing about taking a crown at the beginning is? That means you're guaranteed to fight the IDPD when you get to the palace. Because I think they only spawn at on the beginning of palace levels if you've activated a crown vault. If you've acted two, activated two crown vaults, they'll spawn on... 7-1 and 7-2. In fact, I think the level that they spawn on directly correlates to whether you activate the crown vault on 3-2 or 5-2. So like 7-1 is 3-2 and 7-2 is 5-2. I could be like dead wrong. I could be like straight up lying. But that is my theory. Yeah, I can never be that guy because I don't say annoying things and play the wrong music for a video game. Good, my worst, least favorite mutation, shotgun shoulders. Seriously though, when he did the Binding of Isaac one, he played freaking Super Meat Boy music the entire video. Literally the entire video. Oh. We'll give it another shot. Hammerhead, ah, oh, come on, we can do better than that. All right, let's just, let's reset until we get something really good. Dre, dre, dre. Oh, missed out on Rhino skin, because I'm dumb. Oh, did it again, because I'm still dumb. Wow, it seems like we're only seeing the same mutations. Oh, oh, bip, bip, oh okay. Am I a cheater? Uh, probably. I don't know. I couldn't do this on the daily, but this isn't the daily. This is me trying to loop twice with melting, so. You get what you. <laughs> you get what you ask for, goddammit. And if it takes a little bit of reset arena to happen, then you're just gonna have to deal with it. Okay, the shovel isn't actually that great for us because I don't have long arms. Christ. I might just reset again. It's just so useless. We may actually get like a shitload of levels on this level, so we may be saved. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, there are so many memes on this level. This is insane. Long arms, boiling veins. Well, now I have a reason to keep this cursed shovel that I already had to keep anyway. Bazooka. Sure. Here 
Ooh, cursed ammo. It's been a while since I've seen that, and certainly never with melting. Also, like, really unlikely to get this with melting, so... That's also a thing. The sewers stink. Agreed. At least this means we can go to our turtle secret level. With a relatively free price of only one bazooka shot. See ya! Thanks for the rads, pussies. I feel like pussies is in a, is gonna be the next uh, word that's considered extremely offensive. Um, following. Oh, let's see what else. Probably like. Well, I don't really know. But in the same sense, that kind of like the word retarded is now considered really rude. So. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to get out of saying that, but that's just uh, my prediction. Mark my words. If that is true, everyone watching this video owes me a million dollars. Just imagine that that was it said in Mike Myers' impression of uh, Dr. Evil. Oh. Cursed ammo. You sly dog. Look, we're almost back at full health. Uh, trigger finger shovel long arms is not bad. Cursed ammo. Glad the cursed ammo seems to only give us the ammo we actually need, even though we clearly have a melee weapon, so it could be giving us random ammo. Just give me all the rads back, baby, and we'll be alright. See ya. Ooh, heavy crossbow. I'm intrigued, but I can't take that, because that is not cursed. Hey, plutonium hugger. You know, if you think about it, this is still third time's a charm, because uh, this is the third time we came across rhino skin in uh, when we were resetting. Damn it. <sighs> One more time. Something, something, fourth time's the charm. All right. I don't know why I keep taking these cursed weapons that aren't very good. My head is just stuck around the notion of always take all cursed weapons, even when they're bad, because I'm so used to only taking ground of curses. This actually works out since we have Rhino Skin. Maybe this will be the run. Do you say goodbye? Oh, shit. Oh, that'll be the run. Oh, that'll be the run. Uh, run. That I die. More like loop twice. Kind of works. That'll be the loop. No, that'll be the run that I loop two times. It, it kind of works. It kind of works. Gotta give credit to the kind of rhyme. Help. Help. You're toast. Toasty. Make French. Wish I could switch this SMG after that shovel, because it's probably more useful. Actually, the SMG has kind of been treating us nicely. Hey, Rabbit Paw. These are three very good mutations. Now I'm sure the game's going to give me a lot of weapon specific mutations that I don't care for. 
Ooh, look, a cursed ammo chest. Yay, a flame shotgun. I like this. Cursed weapon chest, whatever. I like it better than the SMG, so we are going to roll with it, since you can switch curse for curse. Yo, 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 curse for curse. Come on, dude. Don't be a puss. I really like the flame shotgun. It is an awesome weapon. A really great, like, cool idea for a weapon. And it's nice seeing diversity in all weapon types. Oh, what? This is like the run. Don't F it. Don't F it. Last run was total memes and I still somehow made it to Big Dog. Now I'm just gonna die <laughs> in the crystal caves. You, 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 you. Ooh, watch out for those slow poison shots. Watch out for those slow poison pans. That was supposed to be sort of a filming reference, but I didn't really complete the joke. It was kind of missing an element, you might be able to tell. Um, yeah, you need to die. The element of surprise! That is a get smart quote. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I think he says it like Safra. It doesn't really matter. It's when he like flips the phone at the uh, his prisoners when he's in like the Russian factory thingy. Yeah, it's a bakery on the front and actually produces nuclear weapons. Ah! Don't lose strong spirit while you're reminiscing over Get Smart. One of my favorite movies of all time. Open mind. That's not bad. I mean, it wouldn't go like good either. <laughs> hey, X Health. Um, need to chill out, sir? Okay, I really don't need that health. Oh, but we got it anyway. Didn't even mean it. <laughs> Help, 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 help. Okay. Oh, thanks for the max health immediately. It's like the game just knows. Not that it has a choice to not know, really. Um. Yes, thank you. Wrench, and what is that, a wave gun? No, it's a jackhammer. Ugh, boiling veins. Kill the crystals before they teleport. Fact number one. And then just pray that those guys don't multiply too much. And that's uh, that's the cursed crystal caves for you. Getting kind of lucky so far, I must say. But uh, it probably won't last. Being melting, we still get the extra rads, even from killing... The ones that aren't supposed to drop any rads, so... Not all hope is lost. Not to mention this area just gives a shitload of rads anyway. Um... Open mind is the greatest mutation of all time? Okay, now I get my choice of some great weapons. I think I will take heavy machine gun... ...and laser rifle. That went very well. Insane. And we only get one mutation and it's freaking stress. <laughs> oh, I felt like I got way more experience than one mutation's worth. Okay, game. Okay. 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 <laughs> I think I just like just gotten the mutation going into the big dog fight, so that kind of explains it. Sort of. Yo, but like, when is Throne Butt gonna happen? Crown of Destiny? Come on. Don't skimp on me. I know you're hiding. I know you're trying to hide all the good stuff from me. So I guess it doesn't really matter if we get Plutonium Hunger. I mean, it does for medkits, I suppose. 
but if we're gonna be rolling this for a good while, um, there we go. Gonna keep using this laser rifle, it's gonna be much better for us. I wouldn't mind going into the crown vault just to uncurse these in case I find better things. But uh, they're kind of working out for us right now. Die, car man. Car man, sand, Iago. Okay. Not doing too bad. I did use the forbidden weapon. Not really forbidden, but the gun that I told myself I should stop using. We may actually get our ultra before fighting the throne. I am not going to complain about that. Um, his car disappeared. Freaking valet. My goodness. Kids have it too easy these days with their fancy valet. Alright. I got 10 energy for that? Oh, Jesus. Well, at least that uncursed my weapons. So, that's, that's what it works. And I seem to recall that I said that I wanted to un... Okay. Not cool. Not cool. Not cool, little hunter. Oh yeah, stress. Nope, he's gonna sniper shot me. No. Strong spirit saved me. Okay, it didn't need to save me, but I was glad that it was there in spirit. Hey, look, we're back at full health. We're gonna do it. Well, at least we're gonna make it to the labs. Ah! Get out of my face. Get out of my face. My face. Get out. Get out. Leave me alone. Ah! Full panic mode. Full panic. Full panic. I'm grab the camera. I'm gonna make it to the labs with melting. We beat little hunter. I read this on the wiki the other day, but uh, I didn't know this. Little hunter's gun is called little Gunter, which is named after, or little Gunther, which is supposed to be named after the little penguin of the Ice Kings in Adventure Time. So that's cool. There's level nine, so it's feasible that we could get our ultra before the throne, but I wouldn't put any guarantees on it. Cool thing about being melting is that you can blow up all these corpses so that these nerds don't get to spawn anyone. Rip, I did not mean to do that. Oh great, Skype, not now. Not now. Okay. Plasma rifle may actually be better than the laser rifle. I know, crazy, right? But we are gonna do that. Eagle eyes. What a guy. Oh, this is what I get for doing Crown of Destiny melting. I mean, if you think about it, it's kind of like playing melting on easy mode since I did reset until I got rhino skin. Um, I found my weapon. We don't have any weapon specific mutations. Um, except for like eagle eyes, that doesn't really count. Shuffle. That's like particularly bad now. Ooh boy. Plasma rifle may actually be a higher DPS um, against the throne than the Gatling Slugger, but I don't care. Okay, there has to be a shielder somewhere, and there he is. Splinter pistol, no thanks. I'm just gonna murder the dudes over here and not let him shoot my enemies for me. So, um, I'm not a big fan of this. Level Ultra! Yay! Nuke launcher! No. Actually. 
F it, dude. We're gonna kill the throne with a nuke launcher. Well, this is the only thing I get to pick from. Oh god. Shotgun shoulders, bolt and arrow, laser brain. Oh. Jesus. Heavy crossbow. This is my own doing. <sighs> well, now we only have three health. <laughs> so. Second stomach is, like, entirely useless now, but I didn't have a choice in the first place, so whatever. <laughs> yeah, brain capacity is not that great <laughs> when <laughs> you have crown of destiny. Oh, God. Almost resized the window there. He's low on health. Oh, he's really low on health. How? No! <laughs> Are you kidding? How? I mean, you see all these enemies, right? Like, there's no way I wasn't gonna get hit by one of their projectiles, but come on! How did that nuke not kill it? Oh. <laughs> oh hush, you you freaking cheaters. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And uh I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.